from Skipla, run back, see how do these pharma stocks look to you on the charts? Well, typically they are uh, classified under defensives, but even if you look at the pharma space, for example, I think you will see some sort of dichotomy between different sets of stocks. Sun Pharma, for example, is trading at all-time highs. Divis has pushed up to all-time highs quite recently. Uh, I think Dr. Reddy has been trading up at all-time highs, but uh, recently taken a bit of a drubbing. I'm very comfortable staying long in stocks which are either at all-time highs or pushing into all-time highs. I think that as a, as a kind of approach is something that I always advocate and I'm very, very happy following that as a, as a kind of practice. CIPLA has always been part of the rumor bill and uh, it's sort of building up but it's not really delivering on a long-term basis. It keeps delivering if you're just taking a month-long kind of view, then you get those short spurts where you make some money, but then it just kind of goes into a limbo. I think run back C is a bit too much of a yo-yo for, uh, you know, for a kind of positional hold. So I think there also one would have to take a slightly uh, trading type approach. But if you really want to be in the defensive, be in Strides Arco Labs or be in Divis or be in, uh, you know, Sun Pharma where it doesn't give you any kind of heart, uh, you know, heart attacks periodically like the Ranbaxis and Siplas and the other stocks too. Even though quality-wise, you may talk about them in the same breath, but in the market, they are certainly being seen at, uh, you know, pretty differently. Mm.